Your boy's sponsored now. What is up guys, welcome back. In today's video, we are doing an unboxing. I have an exciting new package to open and an exciting announcement to go along with it. Let's get into it. What is up guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Zach with Dr. Eyeball MD. If you guys are new, welcome back. We focus on everything about medical school, residency, ophthalmology, oculoplastic surgery, life as a doctor, surviving in medicine, all that cool stuff. In today's video, we are doing an unboxing. What do I have in my box here? So we will see shortly. I'm not gonna draw this out like those long unboxing videos that you see. Uh, for all the tech YouTubers out there, we're gonna cut it open and get to the meat of this. So while I open it, let me tell you who this is from. Uh, why I got it and I think it's gonna be pretty exciting. So This is from a company called Oroscoptic this box with my new loops in it. So Oroscoptic uh, is a company that I think maybe not a lot of physicians know about so much as people on the dental side uh, But I kind of came across them on Instagram actually but also in my journey to find new loops when I started my oculoplastic surgery residency um, I essentially wanted new loops. Uh, I had some designs for vision loops. I just wanted to get a new pair since I was doing oculoplastic surgery. And so uh, I reached out to Designs for Vision again, tried on some of their like kind of higher end loops. Uh, and then I met with a company called Surgitel. That was my second company. Um, and I like their loops better than I like the Designs for Vision loops overall. But I didn't like their frames as much. I didn't really care for the frames uh, that the Surgitel company had. And then I. Uh, reached out to this company Oroscopic and I met with their rep and I liked their loops uh, really well and then I liked the frames really well so they kind of had uh, the best of both worlds for me. I feel like for a lot of people the the frames are maybe not so important just you want good loops, you want a good light, that kind of thing. I like the aesthetic of the uh, of the loops so I wanted some that looked cool. I wanted cool looking frames uh, and so that's why I went with this, this brand and also uh, their customer service was the best. I would rank them number one, Surgitel number two, Designs for Vision. Uh, I had the most difficult time setting up meetings with and just working with the representatives. So that's why I've gone with Oroscoptic. Now in the last video I made where I got my, where I bought that pair of loops, I bought that pair of loops myself and I reviewed it and I really love those loops and I still use those loops every day um, over my Designs for Vision loops that I used to have. Uh, but since then, the company I have partnered and so now these loops are free. They sponsored me, I guess, or I'm one of their evaluators, if you want to think of it like that. So they've given me these loops free in full disclosure. So, you know, this will be, I'll keep this as unbiased as possible, but it can't be completely unbiased given the fact that they uh, gave me these loops for free. I do have to give these loops back after I've evaluated them for six months or I can buy them uh, at a marked discount from them if I want to. So either way, but let's open it up. So let's, let me go through uh, everything here. So their case is super nice. It's very nice material. It's very hard. Uh, it has this handle. The only thing I'd like to see on the case is potentially uh, little loops where I could do like a shoulder strap. Um, and so for that reason, I actually end up not using my other oroscoptic case uh, because it doesn't have like a strap like that that I can can carry like a briefcase and I don't really want to hold it like a briefcase. Uh, so I end up using a little Sony camera bag actually to hold my loops. But the case itself is really nice. I just like to see a uh, shoulder strap um, ability to put a shoulder strap on it. Inside we have all these forms and things. It comes with this screwdriver to adjust the screws if you need. Um, I actually, uh, I got mine with the light, so the lights that uh, this company makes are really nice. They're not as bright, I feel like, as uh, the Surgitel and sometimes the Designs for Vision lights because um, one of my attendings has the Designs for Vision light and one of uh, the other fellows I know has the Surgitel light. And I feel like the, the Surgitel light is the brightest, but it's a more harsh blue color. And the nice thing about these lights uh, is that they have that true tone color, so it's more of like a natural kind of like a yellowish warm light, so it's not like you're looking at a bright blue LED light. Um, and I really like the casing. The casing on mine is definitely nicer than either the Designs for Vision or the Surgitel uh, battery packs. It's really hard, uh, durable battery case. It has this inset uh, button, and it has three settings, tap, 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 to go uh, between the three settings on brightness. Um, comes with the charger for the light. Um, and I, you know, I'm not ever running out of battery in the middle of my surgeries. 
uh, on my loops, so that's never been an issue for me. And then inside the big case is a smaller case, and I like this case a lot. It's the same material, it's that, that hard material, very firm, it's like not a squishy case. So they, they put some thought into the case, and here you can see if it'll go into focus. There, Dr. Eyeball MD personalized. Guys, the reps for this company are so good, and that actually makes a big difference. If I need anything, they're so responsive to me. To me, that's very important. So the special thing about this, this particular set of loops, uh, I handpicked these because I really wanted to try this uh, particular loop style, is um, the biggest thing is they're adjustable. So I can actually spin this little dial and adjust between different magnifications on the same loops. All right, so let's get into it. I'm gonna take off these stickers. I don't really like these these side guards that come on it. If you if you want that extra splatter protection, you can do it, but I like to live life on the edge, and so I take these off. <laughs> I can't get these things off. They definitely come off. They're, I took them off on my other loops. Good, okay, so this is how I would use them. So. Uh, light here i'm going to take off the actually i'm going to take this off as well there we go so this is how i use it so for me i have the adjustable light here we have the iZoom mini here so i can spin and toggle between 2.5x and 3.5x hopefully, hopefully you can see that so you just spin here to toggle between the two which is super cool now most of the time for me a 2.5x just for what i do personally is plenty i feel like the 3.5x could be helpful in some circumstances for instance i think it could be helpful to me when i'm doing like canalicular eyelid laceration repairs or if i'm doing like an optic nerve sheath fenestration in those instances i think it could be helpful to have a little bit better magnification uh, and get a little bit better view so this is how they look on me. Barring how I look, they look pretty good. Uh, these are actually engraved on the side uh, with Dr. Eyeball and D on one of these sides. It says Oroscoptic on the other. I don't know which is which. Uh, but these are super cool, super sexy uh, loops. So let's see here. And yeah, that, that zoom is pretty nice. So right here I'm at 3.5x and then I just spin here to go to 2.5x. Now this is something I'd have to decide, I think, before uh, before the case starts, obviously. I couldn't be spinning these during the case. I could have someone do it. So based off of what surgery I was doing, I would pretty much have to decide uh, what magnification I wanted these on. And so I can I can zoom in. I really do like that 3.5x, actually. And so, that, and so that's it. These are the iZoom Mini. I'll have to actually take them to the OR and try them out to see how they are. But at first glance, I do like these loops a lot. I like the frame. Uh, let me show you guys the light here, see if it's charged up. Just by habit, throw that over my shoulder. So it just plugs into the battery pack like so. And then you just hold down. It's like a soft touch. It's not like a tactile click or anything. So there's the light. I'll shine it at myself here so you can see it. So it's pretty bright. And then it actually gets two shades brighter there. I don't know if you can, can make that out, but can toggle through the different brightnesses on it. It's a nice round beam. Two, three. You can see the brightness back there on the wall. And so that's how it works. And then I can actually do adjust this uh, through my gown uh, so I can say sterile to uh, change through the brightnesses. Uh, but that's how it works. So first glance, that is iZoom Mini from the brand Oroscoptic. I will have to try them out and see how they are and I'll get back to you guys to let you know. Anyways, I hope you guys like this video, this unboxing video. Let me know if you dig this style of video. We could possibly do more. Your boy's sponsored now. All right, I'll see you guys in the next one.